Okay, so we've got the side-to-side -side movement. I've, uh, uh, I've picked a, a point in his body, let's say uh, in here. He's pretty clean there, but I'll pretend that's the point. I'll relax it out uh, until I've, I've got him floated. Now we repeat. And uh, this time when I go to relax him out, he consciously drops, connects through me, and floats me in return through the movement that he's, that he's working on, picks my base up. And then we rotate again. I go a bit lower in his body. I find that point there, down around his hip. And now he, he drops into a stance. He floats me, and he sends the energy underneath my base and just drops underneath what I just released and takes ownership of that, of that area. Uh, so here there's a bit of a catch point there. Now he folds the quoi, touches my base, comes underneath, and then this one here, there we go, and brings the energy through and back. And then you, so you, you pick the tension up, float your partner, and then your partner comes back and then they float you through that, that place where you just released and you just keep, keep going through it. So you, your skill has to be at a level that you can float your partner through any contact point. So my partner touches me here, I've got to be, be at that skill level where I can do that. So he releases my shoulder, boom, and there, and then I release him underneath the shoulder he just released. And then you just loop backwards and forwards. So it's a bit like that game, you're playing push hands where you touch your partner's base, float them, they recover and float you. Now we're doing it through punching lines. Whatever line the body you want to get strong, we're just releasing through that and counter-releasing your partner backwards and forwards with this, uh, this game. Okay, have a play.